Next year, Samsung is planning to release the Galaxy F55, which will be the successor to the Galaxy F54, their popular mid-range smartphone. Some details about this upcoming phone have recently surfaced online. One of the most exciting features of the Galaxy F55 is its new Exynos chipset. This is like the brain of the phone, and it's called the Exynos 1480. What's special about it is that it comes with a graphics processor made by a company called AMD. This graphics processor, known as the Eclipse 530 GPU, is built using a technology called AMD RDNA 2 graphics, which is similar to what they used in a previous phone called the XNS 2200. While it might not be as advanced as the RDNA 3 graphics you find in some high-end phones, it should still make the Galaxy F55 better at handling graphics and gaming than its predecessor, the Galaxy F54. There's some talk that this new chip could possibly support something called ray tracing in games, which makes games look even more realistic. However, we can't be sure if this feature will actually be included, so don't get too excited just yet. But in terms of graphics, it should be an improvement over the Galaxy F54. Now let's talk about the phone's performance when it comes to regular tasks like using apps and browsing the internet. The Galaxy F55's performance seems to be a bit better than the Galaxy F54, but it's not a huge jump. In simple terms, it's like the phone is a little bit faster, but not dramatically so. When it comes to the software, the Galaxy F55 will run on Android 14 and a Samsung interface called One UI 6.1. This is the software that makes the phone work and look the way it does. It might also include some smart features that are similar to what you find in the more expensive Galaxy S24. As for when you can get your hands on the Galaxy F55, it's expected to be available sometime after March. This is based on the fact that the Galaxy F54 was released in March this year. In the first couple of months of 2024, Samsung is likely to focus on their Galaxy S24 lineup, so the F55 might come out a bit later. What do you think about these updates? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments and stay tuned for more information in future updates. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.